I'm gonna show you my basic dev environment setup for the Mac. Check it out. Homebrew will be your package manager. Use it to install everything else. iTerm will be your terminal. Make sure to install OhMyZSH along with it to make it even better. Now you need a code editor. Personally, I prefer Sublime Text for JavaScript, but anything will do, it doesn't really matter. If you do end up using a GUI-based code editor like Sublime, I highly recommend setting up a keyword to allow you to launch it from the terminal. First we'll create a new folder for our project, then we'll create an index.html file, and then we'll launch it in our code editor. Put in some HTML and let's host it on a local HTTP server. Personally, I really like the HTTP server node npm package, but Python also has a built-in simple static file server as well. Now go to localhost on the port you specified and you'll see your website. Yeah. Now you're gonna want some version control. I recommend Git because that's what pretty much everybody uses. Initialize the repository, add the file to staging, and commit. Right now I'm making a change to the file. When I run a git status, I'm gonna see that the file's modified and then I'll make a second commit. You're now a lead programmer. My name's Jay Diculous. If you enjoyed that video, let me know. Subscribe, maybe, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Tell me, do you know? Tell me how you feel, uh, I've been on the road